All right, this is fall, and we are going to be making some Hudson Bay bread that uh, I will be taking to the uh, Bushcraft 101 class in North Carolina for Midwest School of Bushcraft. Um, this will be our lunch on Saturday. Um, I am increasing the recipe that Terry put, uh, Iowa Woodsman put on Bushcraft USA. I'll be raising it by a third because we have a few more people than we did uh, at the classes that I attended back in the fall. So, we have a very large mixing bowl, but I've already put in, instead of three, four quarters of real butter, room temperature. We'll be putting in 12 cups of this uh, Quaker Oats, a cup of ground walnuts, about half a cup of honey, half a cup of K-Row syrup. And uh, I do not have maple flavoring, so I will be using real vanilla extract. We don't play in this house with the fake crap. Sugar, of course. Here's our ingredients. Um, ready to be mixed. All right, here's the mixture. Sands, walnuts, and um, the oatmeal. All right, here we go. We have a cup of walnuts. That's a ground cup, uh, not pre-cut before, but a cup of walnuts ground up. Then we're going to add 12 scoops of quick oats. So you might as well use the whole thing. So now it's time to mix this stuff together. That's why you have a big bowl. mixed. Got to pan it up and cook it. I hope I did this right. Here is a good size baking sheet. I do not know what size it is. I could probably measure it, but why? Of the material. And then I've got two rectangular cake pans with a half inch inside there. Um, that one's full and this one is obviously not all the way full, but I squared it up somewhat. And uh, we're about to start cooking. So I've got the oven heated up to 325. We're going to put this in for 15 minutes, take it out, press it down with a spatula while it's still hot. And um, so it'll come together and not crumble, um, according to Iowa Woodsman. And then I'll cut it when it's warm. All right, I had to do it through two batches, but uh, I have just taken these out, these two cake pans. They're done, pressed down flat. You can press them. Just took both of those out. This one is already um, cooled off enough, but that one's been cut up. That is a very dense meal. I imagine uh, through hiking or something, you add some protein to this, like some uh, pemmican or something like that. Boy, you'd just be jacked up on this stuff. Plenty of fiber. I've had these before, and let me tell you, there's fiber. Yeah, buddy. There's 14 folks that are going to have to eat 36 Hudson Bay things. Uh, squares. So, uh, enjoy. <laughs> 